You were talking about how hard it is to wear um, Citripio's armor, you know, from your arms, getting like this. Yeah. You said you were feeling lonely. What was the hardest scene you had to shoot on Citripio that you say, oh my God, this day was a very hard day? Yeah, most of the days were like that. I'm not complaining, it's just how it is. But remember that the, well, the first day was in the desert on Tatooine, outside the land, the land crawler, yeah. Um, with the Jawas, where uh, Luke Skywalker buys Sita and Uncle Owen. And that was the first time I had the costume on, seriously. And it was a nightmare. I had no idea. It had taken two hours to put the costume on, an hour, no, half an hour to put the head on, and then I was ready, and then no rehearsal, just action. Ah! I had no idea what to do. And what did George Lucas said? You said, "Hey, guy, guys, I'm, I'm, I can move, I can breathe." <laughs> no, he just said action. And when I couldn't, I couldn't say the lines. Why, for, no, why, sir, my first job was programming binary loadlifters, very similar to evaporators in many respects. I couldn't say it. They were crazy lines. I was all confused. I was in this costume. Uh, I couldn't see other than like, like this. I couldn't really hear very well. I was uncomfortable. My suit had already broken down here. I wasn't in a good place. And I couldn't say the line. George went, cut, action. I still couldn't say the line, cut, action. I still could, cut. He came over and said, don't worry about the voice. We can fix it later. You can say anything you want. This was very strange. <laughs> Because I, I come from the theater mostly, where all the other actors rely on you, me, saying the script. Otherwise, they don't know what to do. <laughs> so here was George Lucas saying, do what you want. That was my first day. And the worst thing about the day, because it had taken two hours to put on the costume, they didn't want me to take it off at lunchtime. So I stood all day alone. It was really sad. Mm. I couldn't eat. There was nowhere. 3PO doesn't eat. Droids does. This is where the sound comes out, not where the food goes in. If 3PO eats, Ooh, it's very messy. It takes day. I mean, R2D2 ate something once, and he had to be steam cleaned for weeks to get it out. So I spent the lunchtime watching people over there. They were having a nice time. And I was looking out over the desert and feeling incredibly alone. <laughs>